What is going on, world-class athlete? Have you ever stepped up to the baseline and it was an important point? It was your second serve. You started feeling tight. You started feeling anxious. Oh gee, I gotta make this serve in. It's an important point. And, uh, you totally missed your second serve. I can tell you that used to be my experience, but everything transformed for me when I traveled across the country and learned from legendary master coach Rick Macy, who taught five world norm players, including Andy Roddick's serve. And from my experience there, now when it's an important point, uh, I'm able to accelerate out and generate that massive topspin because I've learned exactly what you're gonna master and learn in this video, which is gonna transform your second serve and your ability to execute under pressure. In the first part of this video, we're gonna master the actually, uh, the biomechanically proven principles of how the best players in the world execute their second serve and how you can do it just like them. In section number two, you're gonna master that number one mindset tip that I learned from legendary master Rick Macy about how to really transform anxiety and tension into high levels of performance, confidence, and expansive capabilities. In the last section, I'm gonna provide you with a drill and an exercise that you can execute the next time you step on the court with your best tennis friend to start developing that confidence and execution muscle as well as developing that ATP level second serve technique. So I'm super excited. Let's go ahead and jump right in to developing that ATP level technique. All right, world-class athlete, in this section, you're gonna learn the core key fundamentals that every single top player in the world does on every single second serve, and I'm gonna make it really simple and applicable for you the next time you step on the court. So let's go ahead and dive right into those checkpoints that's gonna allow you to start generating uh, massive topspin on your second serve. We're gonna build it from the ground up. The first checkpoint that you wanna achieve on your second serve, with your stance, you wanna make sure that your right leg is positioned behind the left. This is gonna allow you to get that hip rotated towards the side fence just like that. This allows you when you accelerate to generate more rotational speed from the core. The second checkpoint that you wanna implement on your second serve is the positioning of your trunk. A really common mistake that a lot of players make when they try to hit their second serve is they won't get their chest to go back. Instead, they'll have their chest like this, which doesn't really allow them to generate topspin, but it's more of a side spin shot like that. So really key is that you wanna get that torso leaning back. The third and final checkpoint that you can implement to really generate loads of topspin on your second serve is the exact step-by-step uh, -step structure of the way you should have your hand. So let's go ahead and pull out Rafael Nadal and Dominic Thiem from a side angle. As you'll see, they've both achieved the checkpoint of having their right leg behind, they've both got their torso leaning back, and now with the hitting arm structure, you'll see three checkpoints. Checkpoint number one, the shoulders and the elbow will be in a straight line. Checkpoint number two is their elbow will form a 90 degree angle just like that. And the third and final checkpoint is that their shoulder will be slightly internally rotated. So by achieving all these checkpoints of the feet, which create the hip, and then the chest, and then the hitting arm structure, you're gonna be in a position to be able to generate that massive uh, top spin on your second serve, just like that. So now that you understand exactly technically what you should be doing, let's jump in and cover the number one mindset tip. All right, world-class athlete, now with that technique mastered, I'm going to teach you exactly what I learned from legendary master coach Rick Macy, who taught Andy Roddick serve. And this one mindset tip alone allowed me to transform feelings of tightness and tension into confidence and literally expansion. And I can remember when I was playing sets almost every day at the academy, I started off feeling really tight on my second serve, but by applying this lesson, I was able to start feeling really confident and really be able to execute when it counts. The lesson can be summed up in a single sentence. Everything is a challenge. See, where most people make the mistake on their second serve is when it's an important point, they start to really uh, psych themselves out. They think, well, this is a really important point. I've got to play my best. And uh, they really tense up and uh, they, their performance ultimately drops. But the way you want to shift it is view it as a positive challenge, as an opportunity for you to strengthen that execution muscle. And when you set up on an important point for your second serve, you want to think, this is a challenge, this is an opportunity, I'm going to go for it. 
uh, and then that's gonna allow you to transform that tightness into acceleration and feelings and positive emotions. All right, so now you know the technique, you know the number one mindset tip I learned. Lastly, I'm gonna provide you with a drill and an exercise that you can use the next time you step out on the court. So the fastest way that you can apply all these lessons and the fastest way for you to learn is to put it in a real match play situation. So the next time you step on the court with your number one hitting partner, what I want you to do is play a set. But while you're playing the set, play only from deuce and you only have your second serve. So this is immediately gonna put you in those pressure situations. It's gonna force you to have to develop that skill set of hitting a great serve when it really counts. All right, world-class athlete, I hope you absolutely love, love, love this video today. I had such a pleasure shooting it for you. As always, make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Lastly, you can click the link below to go over my website to get more advanced coaching to take your game to that next level. I'll see you on next week's video. Let's go.